Okay, y'all, so we got a new coochie. She see money all around me. I look like I'm the man. Okay, y'all, so this is what we got. My hair is done. Ooh. Hold it. Got the donkey, yeah, boy. Know what I mean, bitch. On it, on it, on it, on it. They all in my face when I know what I got. Love what you see. You want a deal on my shit so high. Yeah, I bet you catch a feel. I don't know who you are if I'm keeping it real. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's your Sarah Brianna. If you don't know, now you know one of our best friends. Nice to meet you, sis. So, go ahead and make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe when you do. Don't forget to turn on your push notifications so you always are notified every single time I post a video. And make sure that you follow me on social media because I do post there outside of YouTube. Girl, okay, so first off, before we start this video, I feel like I need to address the elephant in the room because my mood, y'all, it's going to be obvious that, like, I'm not in a good mood. If it was up to me, child, I wouldn't be filming at all. I would just be in my room, in the quiet, in the dark, not caring about life, not wanting to participate in anything, not wanting to do anything because... I am very much so heartbroken, you guys. So, the elephant in the room as to why my mood is like this and I'm very down is because I lost my grandmother July 8th. Um, today is July 11th and it is three days before my birthday. I had plans to go on a trip out of the country for the first time ever. I've never been outside the country. Um, I spoke to my family about it because I really wanted to just cancel my trip, cancel my birthday party, or at least, like, push it back or something. I spoke to my mommy about it, and we both came to the agreement that my grandmother wouldn't want me sitting around doing nothing. And to be honest, that's not going to be healthy for me because I know myself. I would literally fall into a depression. So right now, I'm at Target because I need to get me some traveling essentials. We gonna turn up and have a good time for my grandmother because at the end of the day I have to celebrate life and I want to celebrate her homecoming and my 24th birthday. So I gotta stay strong for myself, okay? So let's go to Target, y'all. <laughs> Okay, y'all, we're here. Ain't nobody over here, so I'm pulling my mask down, y'all, because I cannot. So, basically, I look so rough. Oh, my God. Basically, I have to get stuff for myself and my boyfriend because I'm just being a helpful girlfriend. You know what I'm saying? So, why does this look like he's going to run out of it in two seconds? Like, so I'm going to get him two of these because girl oh my gosh y'all so quick story time because i cannot lift up oh wait let's tramp quick story time because i cannot lift up my arm girl so i got vaccinated yesterday well i got my first shot yes i was late to the party because i'm sorry i had to let some other people be the test dummies okay like I'm dropping stuff, but basically, not only did I have to let other people be the test dummies, but girl, I had to let some of my family members get tested first because if your family got it and they good, then it's like, okay, now I know I'm really good. You know what I'm saying? Like, if people in my family didn't have no bad experiences, then... Since we're related, I know that we're going to be okay. You know what I'm saying? So, my uncle had got his in June, and I just got my first one yesterday. So, I can't lift this arm at all. It hurts so bad. So, um, yeah. Girl, I don't know what I want. What I do know is I need to get some of these bottles because y'all... I don't know how I want to do my hair yet, but it's true. 
Y'all probably like, what girl? The trip is in three days, essentially. And I don't know, I know what style I wanna do, but it's like, dang, it's complicated because I don't wanna be doing a lot while I'm on this trip, like at all. And I also wanna be in the pool a lot. And I don't want my hair to get super duper way down, you know what I'm saying? Um, and right now I'm contemplating, like, what am I really gonna do with my hair? Because I see these little bottles of like shampoo and conditioner and stuff. So it's like, I'm gonna put a picture of the style that I want, you guys. And it's like, okay, do I do this with a wig? And you know, that way I'll be able to take the wig on and all and I'll be able to get in the pool and do my do. And then later I'll just have to reapply the wig. Or do I do, you know, the little sewing weaves and that and combo the front of my hair? I don't know what I want to do. So, right now, this is what my cart is looking like, child. All this stuff ran up is going to be like $1,000. Oh, what's this? Ooh, this is some body wash. This is cute. Okay, y'all. So, this is what we got. Excuse this loud ass cart. They don't have any water shoes. So. I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> What's good, y'all? It's the next day. I hope y'all are feeling a little bit better than I am, girl, because I'm stressed and we're about to have a venting session before I go into this beauty supply. But I gotta make it quick because I have a couple of oh, little, little because I have a couple of appointments today, girl. So first off, you know it's hot to tell outside when you have to literally wear your scarf until you get out your car. Not till you walk in the house, no, so you get out your car because it's hot. I don't got no earrings on, y'all. My life is a shampoos, but y'all already know. So, basically, what we have going on today, what it is, today, Tuesday. What it is, Tuesday. <laughs> it really is Tuesday, though. It's July the 13th, it's Tuesday, and today I have a wax appointment and I have a lash appointment. Every single one of my appointments, including my nail appointment for tomorrow, y'all had to get rescheduled and pushed back. Or everybody is stressing me out. It's giving very much unprofessional, but like, we're going to get it together. I'm also stressing myself out because y'all, I think I talked to you guys yesterday about like what I want for my hairstyle. I don't know if I want a wig. I don't know if I want to do a quick weave. The quick weave would make more sense, but I don't like leaving my natural hair out because... This texture is not the texture I want. I want like a loose wave type of look. So right now I'm about to go into this beauty supply and hopefully they have a wig that I like. It needs to be long, loose wave, and the lace needs to give, okay? If it don't, I don't want it. I will literally go to another beauty supply store later. Y'all know I'm not used to buying my own wigs, girl. I was trying to, you know, kill two birds in one stone and do this B-Day hair with one of my collaborations but none of them was trying to promote the wigs that i wanted so i still have to do those other wigs and i still have to find the wig that i want for my birthday so i'm gonna go in here i don't have that much time because my wax appointment is in an hour so let's just go see what we can find and i'll talk to you guys more about everything that happened when we get back in the car or something girl or maybe after my, we're going to talk after my wax appointment because I promised my dad that I wouldn't like actually drive and be on the phone no more. So yeah. Girl, Houston, we have a problem. I went into two different beauty supplies and they didn't have Nathan. Like, you guys, I really just want to get a wig and do the little cornrows and the braiding hair myself because... I know I'm going to take my time. I know my mom is stressed. She got so much going on right now. So I don't want to ask her to help with my hair. But they're basically out of stock on like the loose wave and the deep wave bundles and stuff and like wigs and stuff. And like they lace was real looking real 
janky and it's like dang i never really bought i never bought a wig from the beauty supply ever in my life so i y'all they was like 300 400 dollars and like the lace and the the oh my god the double knots was not giving it so i don't know what i'm about to do but i'm gonna make something shake because i always make something shake okay but right now i'm about to go ahead into my wax appointment i'm early as always super early as on time maybe it's only 3 33 and my appointment is at 3 45 um but yeah we love being on time okay because i don't like rushing and i'm about to get a new wax lady hopefully i like her hopefully she takes her time i like when people do everything okay talk to me make me feel comfortable pluck at the end make sure you get everything yes girl because this bikini line has to be on a point okay and it's getting high in here because i turned the air off so y'all don't have to hear the janky background noise but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and walk over there so I'll see y'all when I'm at my appointment. Did you do anything for the fall? Um, yeah, I just spent time with my family and stuff. We had a little cookout. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It was way more exciting when I was little. Right. <laughs> It does get easier though. Because yes. like when I came back from not having anything over the pandemic, that that first one coming back was a struggle. Yep. Yeah. All right, go ahead and inhale. Inhale, exhale. All right, go ahead and bring these up. Okay, y'all, so we got a new coachie. We got a new coochie, y'all. She was in there getting me together, okay? So right now I'm about to head to my lash appointment. We got some Starbucks. Y'all, I really want a shrimp basket from Popeye's, but the Popeye's on Eastern Market, it smells like death in there. Like, I cannot eat nothing out of there, baby, no. No. And y'all, let me put y'all on to a drink right now. You got to get the... Mango Dragon Fruit Refresher with Lemonade, Light Ice, because they be trying to get over. And you got to add some, um, what is it called? I think it's ginger, lemon ginger, lemon ginger syrup. You got to add that. It tastes so good. It kind of tastes like the regular one. Like, it kind of tastes like my normal drink without it. Last time I had this, I added raspberry syrup, but they was out. The raspberry was good. But the ginger just make it, it make me feel like I'm being healthy. So, that's why I like it. But, yeah, it's already 4 o'clock. My wax girl is 30 minutes away. So, I'm going to head there. Hopefully, I can find some food. If not, I'm just going to have to eat afterwards. I, don't, I haven't even been having an appetite, you guys. Like, my mind, girl, I'm just going through it. But, we got pushed through. And stay strong, okay? So, I will see y'all in a few. I brought my tripod with me. So hopefully homegirl like lets me set it up and y'all can really see me like getting my lashes done because I don't I don't have time to hold my phone the whole time. So anyways y'all, I'll see y'all when we get there. I got my Popeyes, okay? And I have 10 minutes, literally 10 minutes just to put something really quick in my system. I know I'm not going to be able to eat it all, but I'm not even hungry. I just don't want to pass out. Like, I have not been having any type of appetite lately so i'm just trying to keep myself afloat mm -hmm. so y'all let me hurry up and tell y'all what happened with like all my appointments basically i was supposed to go to my last appointment at 12 p.m today 12 20 to be exact and my wax was supposed to be at 3 o'clock. Girl, so... I woke up at 8.30 this morning. Because I knew I had to wake up and do laundry and get myself together. And then, 
homegirl texted me and was like, can you please come at three? And I was like, baby, I got a watch appointment at three. Now I cannot. And she was like, okay, can you come at five? And I'm like, all right, I could do that. I could do that or whatever. Then European Wax Center called me and was like, the girl that's supposed to do your wax is no longer with us. Girl, and that just happened to me last time I went because they already told me that I needed to get a new waxer anyways because she was leaving. So I'm like, oh my God. What's going on? So, is this a shell? This is a shell, girl. Stop back, get it together. Dang, another one? Another one. <laughs> And y'all, if y'all never had the sweet heat from Popeyes, you gotta get it. It tastes so good. Hold on, because I'm dying. I had to turn the air off so y'all wouldn't hear the background, baby. I'm dying, okay? Sweet heat from Popeyes is so good with the chicken tenders. Oh, my God. And the fries. It tastes so good. But, yeah, so. My hair looks a hot mess. And it's about to look even worse because I'm going to lay back on the little table. But, yeah, y'all. On my appointments, which is Haywire. Then, my nail tech look at this man hey mr sir so y'all did my last i mean my nail tech text me was like i know you have an appointment with me tomorrow at 12 20 or 12 one now but can you please come either eight o'clock in the morning on thursday or 12 that thursday and i'm like baby i have a flight at 8 a.m no i cannot I'm going out of the country just for my birthday trip. Like, y'all playing with me. If I take some one more damn show, like, what is it really giving? What is it really giving? Maybe my fat ass put too much of the shrimp in my mouth. But anyways, I'm like, baby, no, I cannot. I understand why she did it. Like, the other girl didn't even tell me, like, why she was pushing it back. European walk to tell me why they had to reschedule. My nail tech was like, I have a doctor's appointment that I cannot miss. And I'm like, girl, I got a flight that I cannot miss. So... Can I come in later tomorrow? So now my nail appointment is at six tomorrow. So hopefully in between when I wake up and six o'clock, I get my toes done and I figure out what the freak I'm gonna do with my hair because that part is just stressing me at this point. What I really should have did is just been bought a wig. I should have got a wig just in case my wig with my sponsorship didn't come through. That way I would have been straight. Um, but anyways, I had one shrimp and I'm already full. That's crazy. Told y'all I don't be having an appetite. I'm not going to throw my food away or anything. Though. I'm going to save it because have y'all noticed that like if you get anything fried, especially when it comes, girl almost dropped my basket, especially when it comes to fried food if you get anything fried you try to warm it up later it tastes disgusting right right if you put it in the microwave it's trash if you put it in the oven sometimes it tastes better sometimes it don't but girl if you got air fryer put all your fried food in the air fryer and put it on the highest degree that's the key that's the tip you gotta put it on the highest degree so it can get real crispy real fast and it be slapping. It tastes like you just got it. So this is the before. Very much basic. <laughs> she see money all around me. I look like I'm the man. Yeah. But I was down and up like last week. Tell me where have you been? Yeah. I'm out of hiding, girl. Like a new man, just a fan. You don't hold me. No, 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 I killed, never be killed, that's real, no lie. You can tell it from my peers right now. Bitch, you wanna fuck me down. Bitch, you wanna love me down. Girl, you can't tie me down like Ray J said. Y'all. 
I was talking to the camera this whole time and it was not turned on. I'm sick boots. <laughs> Mo, I'm going through it. I went to like turn the camera off and realize oh it was never turned on. I'm annoyed, but anyways. Now I gotta redo all of that over. Let me show y'all my lashes. She gave you two little cute spoolies too. We love to see it. Basically, what I was saying was I love my lashes. If you want to know what I got, I got a hybrid set and I got 15 in the inner corner and 16 um, throughout the rest of my eye. What is the girl up there doing? <laughs> I see somebody in the um, window. And the curl is the curl. Super cute. For some reason, I always like this eye better than this one. And she starts with this eye. I don't know if I like this side of my face better. Or, I don't know if she makes this eye fuller because she starts with this one. I think that's what it is. Because to me, this one looks a little... This one looks a little sparse compared to this one. This is my right eye. But I love my lashes. They're super, super cute. Please do not ask me my lash tag name because I'm not telling y'all because... <laughs> because she already be with the busy. So do my nail tag. So, if I already got a fight for an appointment, baby, I'm not about to make my chances go down even more. But I feel as though, like, right here... Compared to this one, this one is more thick. But it's okay, because I still love my lashes. Even though she has to reschedule me, I still tip because you just do that, okay? You don't go around not tipping people, okay? Okay, so before I head home back to my loud ass house, we're gonna hurry up and do a little haul. I just left Beauty Island and I basically spent $1,000 on some bundles. So basically, I got three bundles. This is what they look like. And first off, the packaging is so cute. It's rhinestone. That is too cute. Um, they were expensive. This cost me more than I would purchase. Like this was more expensive than me purchasing a wig online. So this hair better be very much so nice. 100% unprocessed human hair duh of course it's deep wave I got two bundles of 24 and one in 22 and I called my mom when I was in the store and she said she's gonna come with my hair for me so we love that and I also got a weaving net I already have a ton of um thread and I got a lot of needles at home so I didn't have to get that and you guys y'all know I'm going on an airplane and I want to take my bag with me and not get a check so y'all I found these small tiny little bottles from Edge Booster so like they won't throw my stuff away girl I'm so upset first off look at this little ass got to be glue bottle this is too cute like I may need this to like you know do the little curly baby hairs who knows child if I don't use this I'll use this. This is so stinking cute, y'all. Like, and I've always seen these. These are little samplers, but like, this is too cute. Then, girl, I did not know that Style Factor had little bottles of leave-in conditioner, and they got the same exact scents as their edge control. And I love Edge Boosters edge control because it smells so good. Like, this is my favorite scent. Well, this is the only one I ever use. The pineapple one smells so good. I hope this works well. And y'all know I got curly hair, so they have little bottles of mousse. Stop playing with me. And, like, I made sure it was foam because I went ahead and, like, squeezed it in the throat. Yeah, y'all, so my hair about to be gorgeous. My mom will come over to the front. I already got braiding hair, so, and I already got shiny jam, so it's lit. And then I just wanted a new little pair of earrings wear my trip so i'm excited mm -hmm. it's hot for me baby like i basically ain't got nothing for 30 minutes so get shit popping and get up out of here because i have been late the last couple of times i do not want to be late for no more yeah i got a hundred dollars oh cool you did really really good man good job you Tara, Tara, Tara. Tara is a Tara. <laughs> and then when she's not around, they really miss her. And then when she's around, and I know they must be being bad anytime. My you hair is done. Oh, I like it, y'all. It's cute. 
Just give him. Well, just say that just give him. chance to close this video out but here are the nails and the toes and i will see you guys in the vlog